Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got this interesting puzzle. We are supposed to fill out these boxes such that if we add, multiply and subtract, we are supposed to get 21, 5, 9 and 8. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first step we are going to do. Let's go ahead and label these boxes. I'm going to call this box A, this box lowercase b, this box C and this box D. And now let's go ahead and multiply these boxes horizontally A times B equals to 21 and here I have copied down a times b equals to 21 and likewise let's go ahead and multiply b times d equals to 9 and here I have just copied down b times d equals to 9 and now let's add these a plus c equals to 8 vertically and here I have copied down a plus c equals to 8. And finally let's go ahead and subtract c minus d equals to 5 horizontally. And here I have just copied down c minus d equals to 5. And here we got 4 equations and we are going to solve them now. Now let's focus on these two equations in this box. Let's go ahead and subtract the bottom ones. So I can do like this. I'm going to change the sign minus C plus D and this minus. Here we can see this C and minus C. They are gone. So we ended up with A plus D equal to 8 minus 5 is going to give us 3. Now let me go ahead and call this as an equation number 1. And now let's focus on these top two equations in the box. And we are going to solve these equations for B. So let's go ahead and focus on this top equation. I am going to divide both sides by A. If I divide both sides by A, so this a and a is gone so we got b equals to 21 divided by a and likewise we are going to divide the second equation by d this time d on this side and d on this side if we divide this thing this d and d cancels out we ended up with b equal to 9 over d. Now let's focus on these both equations. They have a b on the left hand side. That means I can equate the right hand side. I can write as 21 divided by a equal to 9 over d. Now let's go ahead and cross multiply both sides. So we are going to get 21D equal to 9A. Let's divide both sides by 3 to make things simple. So we ended up with 7D equal to 3A. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and multiply this equation 1 by 3 on both sides. I'm going to multiply 3 on this side and 3 on this side. So we are going to get 3a plus 3d equal to 3 times 3 is 9. And we know that 3a equal to 7 d we figured out before let's go ahead and replace this 3a by 7d so i'm going to put down 7d over here plus 3d equal to 9 so 7d plus 3d is going to give us 10d equal to 9 let's isolate d by dividing both side by 10 so 10 and 10 is gone so d turns out to be 9 over 10 is same as 0 
so our d value turns out to be 0.9 so thus we figure out d equal to 0.9 i'm going to just put down 0.9 in this box and now we can easily find the value of c so c has got to be 5.9 isn't it 5.9 minus 0.9 is going to give us 5 so therefore our c value turns out to be 5.9 and now let's focus on these boxes over here in a we can see that we can put the value 2.1 one if we add 2.1 and 5.9 that is going to give us 8 so thus our a value turns out to be 2.1 and now let's focus on these boxes horizontally 2.1 times what is going to give us 21 so this b has got to be 10 10 times 2.1 is going to give us 21 so our b value turns out to be 10 and now finally we are going to check these boxes right now so b is 10 and d is 0 0.9 if we multiply these two numbers obviously we are going to get 9 so everything looks fine so thus our a value turns out to be 2.1 b is 10 c is 5.9 and d is 0 0.9 Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.